Hi, welcome to Parker's Hose Products Division. Today, we're gonna to be talking about the Park Crimp System. This industry-leading and easy-to-use crimping system is designed to produce reliable, accurate crimps from the first time it's used. With no variable settings to program and no regular calibration required, this system has been proven to provide years of reliable service in the field. By using a par crimp crimper, you'll enjoy several key advantages. Perfect alignment. Each crimper features the park line system, which is a design that positions the fitting directly in the die on a step for a precise crimp every time. Bottom loading. It's much easier to manage longer hose assemblies. Linked dies. Par crimp dies are linked together to limit mistakes. Color coding. Par crimp dies are color coded by size, making it fast and simple to identify what you need for your specific crimp. Durability. Introduced in 1980, these machines are built to last. Decals. All par crimp machines come with an information rich decal providing a list of proper hose and fitting combinations, tooling required, and the crimp specification for each assembly and Crimp Source, the industry's most complete resource for Parker crimp specifications, technical manuals, decals, and more. See for yourself at parker.com slash crimp source. Let's demonstrate how to make a hose assembly in five easy steps using the Par crimp system. Using shop air or an ultra clean pellet, clean the cut length of hose. Now, using the insertion depth block, mark the depth of the fitting directly onto the hose. This step is crucial to the overall process, so make sure the line is visible and in the correct location. A best practice is to mark a T, so even after the fitting is crimped and the line isn't visible, you can visually check the insertion depth was marked before crimping. Insert the fitting onto the hose and ensure the insertion depth mark is directly aligned with the end of the fitting. Using the crimp decal on the crimper, select the correct die and die ring. Insert the unitized die train into the die bowl. For long-lasting durability, lubricate the die bowl frequently with lithium grease or molly coat assembly paste. Now it's time to crimp. Effortlessly pull the lever to engage the pump and hold until the die ring bottoms out to the base plate. Disengage the lever and push back to raise the pusher arm. Pull the hose assembly from the crimper through the bottom of the machine. For 90 degree fittings, Remove the die ring and section of a die to easily remove the assembly. Use a caliper to check the diameter of the crimp to ensure a perfect crimp was created. Make sure to measure along the flat surfaces of the crimp shell. Never use hose assemblies with crimp diameters that are out of tolerance. Crimp diameters can be found on the decal. Now that you know how to make a Parker hose assembly using the Park Crimp system, let's go over a couple quick safety tips. First, never mix and match components from other manufacturers or crimp them using a par crimp machine. These machines are only designed for Parker hose and Parker fittings. Next, never double crimp the fitting onto the hose. Double crimping will weaken the shell and create leak paths. And finally, never repair a hose assembly that's already been in the field by crimping a new fitting onto that previously used hose. So, using what you've learned today, you'll be able to make safe, reliable, and high-performing hose assemblies every time. For any industry, construction, agriculture, forestry, railroad, machine tool, oil field service, waste and refuse, material handling, marine, ground support equipment, and general industrial, we at Hose Products Division thank you for your time and attention watching this training video. For more information on any of our Park Crimp System crimpers, visit parkerhose.com or call 1-800-C-PARKER.